Uh, hey guys, uh, today we have a new face on the block here. This is a 1980s Montgomery Ward industrial commercial. Um, I just picked this up uh, the other day. I'll show you what she's got underneath the hood. It's a 400cc uh, Briggs & Stratton. Um, synchro balanced. Uh, it's missing the flywheel cover. Um, shit. What else do we have here? A 38 inch mowing deck on it. Uh, 7 speed transmission. I think this is forward and reverse. Um, I'm not sure. I'm assuming it is. But, uh, yeah. No belt on the on the mowing deck or uh, no uh, drive pulley. So if anybody knows where I can get a drive pulley for a Montgomery Ward uh, with a model number, let's see if you can pick up on that TMO. Oh, for frig's sakes! It's Focus three 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 nine sixteen A F twelve six C. Uh, I think somebody painted this. The guy I bought it from, I think, painted this or not. I don't know. But uh, 11 horse electric start, 38 inch, 38 inch mowing deck, seven speed transaxle. Uh, the mowing deck's good on it. Uh, and I just have it in storage right now. Uh, this took the Murray's place. The Murray that you saw in that Craftsman video that I posted on my other channel. It depends on what channel I post this on. Um, God, I hate the fucking city, I tell you. Jesus Christ, I can't make a damn video. But anyway, um, yeah, this took the Murray's place. Uh, I took the Murray tractor to uh, my buddy's house. Uh, we took the back transmission off it. This is the way you saw it. It was sitting, you know, right where this is, and without its trans transaxle off, uh, or the uh, tranny, sorry, I'm stuck on this thing now, but uh, yeah, so that's his now, and this is my tractor to place it, I paid 60 bucks for this, uh, without the, without it running, I think the guy I bought it from dropped a new engine on it, because it has a headlight uh, clip off the magneto, to uh, power headlights and this thing has the headlights disconnected obviously so I'll have to rewire these um, I never wired a tractor before I'm just I'm getting into the I mean I'm good with the tractors and stuff but not the wiring I am not good at the wiring so this is gonna be a freaking learning experience for me a learning curve, I guess you call it. But, yeah, all the wiring is just effed up on it. I think this is for the headlight uh, clip. It has a motorcycle battery that went in here. I took it out because it's it was bad, so I'm going to try and charge it up. And the, uh, the bolts on it that were holding it together were rusted, so... I had to take those off, but uh, this I don't even know what that goes to, so uh, it just uh, everything underneath here is just freaking spaghetti to me. I don't know what goes where, or maybe this goes, this guy here goes on this little guy there. Uh, yeah, I think that goes there. I put a new ignition module on it, but of course it doesn't work. And when you turn, when you start the engine, the choke. There we go. Uh, when you start the engine up, it's it over revs and and shuts down. So I don't know if it's what what it's going, what's what it's doing, or what's going on. So I still gotta figure this damn thing out. But uh, excuse me, sorry. Uh, yeah. Um, yeah, the belt's, part of the belt's still on it, I think. I'm not sure. I, I don't even know. I, everything, like I said, everything on this is, I'm still learning what 
what's what and getting my bearings with this damn tractor. Um, yeah, it also has uh, reverse lights or brake lights or whatever. These. Okay, here's part two. Uh, sorry about that. The, I had like a little two, bi uh, two gig card in it and the damn thing just friggin' just, just dies. So, part two. Uh, okay. Um, yeah, uh, I've taken the headlight cover shroud thing off because I hated it and it looked like shit. So, that's out, but I have no idea if these headlights work or not. Uh, I'm assuming they do, so, frig, I hope they do. <laughs> but, uh, yeah, um, I would jump it, but, nah, I don't feel like starting it right now. Uh, but hopefully I can get this plow mounted on it. Something. That or the John Deere's plow. But not that's going to be used for the John Deere, so. I don't know. I don't know, tubes. I don't know. I'll give you another. Give you a view over here. Wrinkle. There's the throttle. Ignition, the choke. I don't know. If anybody else out there has a Montgomery Ward, is the choke always that difficult to push in? <clears throat> Damn. It's like plastic rubber. I don't know. But if anybody has a year or model number on this, well, I got the model number, but a, a like a downloadable manual for it or something, uh, that would be awesome. If you could pass it along to me, just uh, private message me or something, whatever. But uh, there's a 38 inch deck uh, emblem there. The fuel filter looks a bit uh, decked. Oh, for Frank's sake, shut up, Ringo. But yeah, here's another. Here's a back look here, a re rear, rear view. You can see that these are indeed wired headlights. So I don't know if these were an afterthought. Somebody mounted these on here or what. I don't know if they work. I haven't tested them. Somebody painted this a nice flat black color. Cause you can see this was red at one point in its life. It's got, I think, the original tires. They're a bit soft, obviously. This one's pretty good. I'm, I'm anxious to see how fast this freaking thing goes. I wish I could stab a Kawasaki engine on it. Because it idles high and it's loud. The seat's comfy, though. <laughs> Not too bad. You can't see the amps on it because the amps are all washed out. I'm thinking about replacing this thing here. If I can take it into service, I don't know. I'm thinking about just taking it in and having them stab a new pulley on it. Well, yeah, I'll give you some. See if we can get you down to see the pulley there. Ah, uh, maybe not. <laughs> but yeah, the drive pulley is indeed missing. So. She needs a new drive pulley, possibly a new starter motor uh, screw there, you, if it'll focus. There it goes, it just takes a minute. Yeah, you can see the threads on that are pretty fucked up, so if I put this screw on there, or this nut, it's, yeah, it won't thread, obviously, so. I think this bolt here was the, uh, frickin', uh, from the, uh, uh, battery, battery terminals, so. But yeah, I think somebody dropped this engine on it, a new engine in this, because uh, obviously there's no bolt here, it's there, and there, and somebody threaded new bolts on it and stuff. Um, let's get another view here inside. Uh, starter motor is okay, I haven't taken the, the uh, it's got a metal color. So that's cool. Pretty much everything on this is metal. Maybe except these. Uh, no, I think these are even metal. The headlight covers. Or headlight things. Those are metal. That's metal. A plastic fuel tank, but... Yeah. Freaking right. Steering's good on it. It doesn't pop like that other piece of shit Craftsman tractor I had. That thing was a piece of shit. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Glad I got rid of that. 
But, uh, yeah, there's even a throttle linkage right there or something off in the engine. And it's not even hooked up to anything. Because this is a, there's a choke here. And Buddy put a new throttle cable on it. So that, that works. And I've read, I've looked on the internet and I, I found similar Montgomery Wards. And I think you have to shut the fuel off to these. If you don't, I think it, uh, ruins the engine or something like you dump it leaves fuel inside the cylinder or something I don't know but that there maybe is that is that the throttle part of the throttle linkage mm -hmm. I don't know. I'm still doing some you know research on it and everything so I don't even know what that goes to either. This little plug here, I think at the ground or something. Oh, not getting it on film. Right there, there's a spark plug. Spark plug wire is pretty. Oh shit, the spark plug's a bit loose. Here, let's, let's see if we can get the spark plug off. Oh, ouch, motherfucker. Sorry about that. I, I do apologize for the swearing. Holy shit, look at this little guy. That's a spark plug right there. Focus. Focus. Thank you. Freak's sake. This engine does fire. SP34 or whatever the hell that is. This is like a freaking two-cycle spark plug almost. Like the spark plug on my tractor is bigger than that son of a bitch. Let's put that guy back in there. So I don't screw that up. I don't know. Somebody wrote good on it. I'll put that back on. I don't know why this freaking cord's so freaking long. I don't know. Maybe it was up here or something. No, I don't. I don't know. I don't know, tubes. I don't know. This tractor is still a mystery to me. I may sound like an idiot talking about this thing, so I do apologize. Oh well, I can't get the spark plug wire back on. There it goes. Okay. But uh, yeah, the the freaking wiring and everything is just just freaking pooch. So we'll have to we'll have to see about this guy. So you can see part of the, the belt right there. I don't know. It's got like three different belts on it. That's loose. That's probably not good. So yeah. If anybody has any um, uh, manuals or anything to say about this tractor, let me know. I think it was made by MTD. Montgomery Ward was like a convenience, uh, like a shopping mall thing or whatever. And MTD actually produced the tractor for them. And they did, ugh, excuse me, they just slapped their logo on it. So, I don't know. But somebody painted this. I guess this was all crinkled in and Buddy fixed it. That's what he told me when I bought it. So I was like, okay. This, I don't know what that is. Maybe that's forward reverse or this is forward reverse. I don't know because I haven't driven it yet. Right now it's in fast. Maybe put her in first or whatever. It don't matter. So she's on level ground. But, uh, yeah, um... I'll give you the model number again so you can uh, see that. Oh shit, I hate this camera. I don't know if you can see that. No, this piece of crap. I'll write the model number down in the, the description and shit, so. But, alright. That's probably not supposed to be like that. Oh well. Back under the tarp. I do like to try and keep this nice. So there she sits. I'll cover it up cold because this whole damn thing's all metal, so that's what I like about it. It's all metal. But yeah, uh, if anybody has any information on that tractor, the Montgomery Ward, let me know. Send me a message. 
comments, anything. So, uh, yeah. Thanks for watching, and uh, we'll talk at you later, tubes. Bring your rights. John Deere.